Happy. I'm here with Bob Brown right now. Well, I just uh, bought a new gun. It's the Wagner. It's a hundred dollar gun. It's a. It works worlds better than the gun I had before, which I'll show you later. But it basically, big tank comes off. There's no filter inside, which is kind of weird. I thought that there would be a filter on the end of the thing there, but there isn't. And because I don't want to run out in the middle of the door, I'll make sure I got plenty of paint in here. You just pour it in. Now normally you would screen this or filter it somehow, but it's all brand new, so I'm not really too worried about it. Besides, these aren't my doors. They belong to a friend of mine, Dave, so I don't really care. As we always say, I don't care, not one bit. But this is a lot of neat features on this thing. You can move around over here. I am. You just stay okay, there. Okay, it's got a, a nozzle here that goes from a wide angle to a narrow angle just by flipping this thing here. You can change the direction of the spray. When it's facing upwards, it means the spray is actually coming out like this. So you can rotate it. So now it's coming out like that. That is the way I prefer most of my spraying is like this. Got an on off switch here. One nice feature about this thing is before when you ran low on paint and you pulled the, the, the tank off and you turned it back on, the first couple shots, and it could be 20 seconds later, you get a couple of big splatters out of it. This doesn't do that. It has a big fan in here. The other one was a vibrator sprayer. This has a big fan. Can you hear that? It actually blows out hot air, which I guess makes the paint dry faster. I normally wear a mask, but I'm going to take it off. Well, I'm going to wear a mask anyway because I'm not dying on Dave's job. Yeah, Dave drove. He's now applying the respirator. Now watch out. You don't get too close because the wind's blowing this way and you get on the camera, which is my phone. Okay, turn it on. I got the blade going like this. Normally you never want to paint outside like this because dirt, bugs, everything lands in it. But we have no choice. There's no other place to put it, so this is where we're doing it. I got a drying rack over here for most of this stuff, which is where I'm gonna put this door on. I'm only doing one side of the door at a time, that way I can lean it against stuff without making paint marks all over everything. Now I could sit there and film all day, but once you've done one, you've done them all, so it's pretty much the same. Um, this wood has tannic acid in it, which leaves a brown haze that came out. They were varnished originally. They were washed with trisodium phosphate and then later on sanded and then washed again with vinegar and alcohol in it. The people that lived in the house before smoked a lot and smoking also comes through. So I'm not sure if this is a factor of the smoke or if it's a factor of the tannic acid in this type of wood. It might be cedar. I'm not really sure. But, um, so the first coat was done with just a normal um, Kills 2, which is a water-based product. Oil works better, but it's really messy and hard to get oil-based, and you don't want to mess with oil-based again. But the premium, uh, this premium Kills 2 works fairly well at stains. So the tannic acid, it pretty much stops it. Sometimes it takes two coats to do it. Um, Dave only going to get one because we don't really care. This is Dave's job, so we I'm don't cheap. care. I'm cheap. <laughs> 
So anyway, um, that's it for today. And here's the other gun. Let me get that to show you what the other gun was. One of these vibrators top. This is about 15 years old, so the technology at the time was pretty good. This is actually good for doing like outside stuff, but uh, it doesn't do a fine enough mist. Uh, it's kind of like sputters, look like almost like a fine orange peel job. Um, so I've had this long enough, and I'm always worried about it dying. Uh, sometimes I pull the trigger, nothing happens, and I got to pull it again, and then it might start start vibrating, um, and it leaked a lot. So I uh, got the new one out. So anyway, that's it. Goodbye.